this is Nikki in Niagara coming to you from Niagara Falls, Canada. And today we're going to take a look at Square Halloween by Belba Family. And this is an eight and a half inch square coloring book uh, with the three by three millimeter grids. So there's our front cover. It's a glossy front cover. We have a spine with no information on it. The back shows us the color palette that will be used throughout the book, and then we've got nine sample pages here. And the two that I've done in here are not on the back, so that's cool. This book is printed on Amazon paper. They have a palette at the front that you can cut out or tear out and uh, use that throughout the book, so that's what I did. Um, same as any Belba family book, we have an introduction and then we start right into the uh, grids. So we have a, uh, a square grid that we're going to fill in using the color chart and that will give us a finished picture. So that's what each page is like. Now, instead of just showing you the blank grids throughout the book, I will show you two pictures that I did. Well, the first one is this, and I, this is just awesome. Uh, I'm calling it a sugar skull bat. Oh, that's one thing about this, this book. It doesn't have a table of contents like some of the others do, so it is a surprise with what you do. So um, I do my my grid colorings by doing the background color in the cross stitch method and then all the foreground uh, material is done with straight coloring and I really like how this turned out. Only thing is is I don't know what this is. There's kind of like a an X or an H that is left white and I'm kind of not understanding what that's supposed to be. Otherwise I love this picture. And then the second one I did turned out to be like um, a voodoo witch doctor <laughs> with a background of the sea and the moon in a tropical area. You think of Haiti as being where they have these uh, voodoo witch doctors and that's a tropical area. So this, we've got our little ghost in the corner and uh, a couple of hands. Well, I guess those are his hands. So we're seeing his face and his hands being held up like this. So, yeah, I really enjoyed doing that. And I'm really looking forward to working in this book this Halloween. I think I'll put aside the book I'm currently working in and uh, work in this book for Halloween. So, that's the end of the book. Let's see what we have at the back. Probably the thank you page with the social media information. And then the complete the complete uh, a series of books that they have made. So once again, this is a square Halloween by Belba family. Thanks for watching. Bye.